Hey, everyone. Welcome back to Fix Netflix, your go-to channel for solving PlayStation troubles. Today, we're tackling the dreaded PS5 captioned error code, an issue that pops up when there's a problem with your game application. I've analyzed feedback from over 500 users and compiled the four most effective solutions to fix this issue. So, stick around, we're about to dive into them right now. Step 1. Let's start with the simplest solution, reinstalling the game. This is Sony's first recommendation and works in most cases by clearing corrupted files. Here's how you do it. Select the game that's causing the error. Press the Options button on your controller. Scroll down to Delete and Confirm. Once it's deleted, go to your game library. Navigate to My Collection, use the Sort by Filter like Most Recent or A to Z to locate the game and reinstall it. Easy, right? This step often resolves the problem quickly. Step 2. Clear the cache and rebuild the database. But what if reinstalling doesn't do the trick? Don't worry, we've got more solutions. Next, let's try clearing the cache and rebuilding the database in safe mode. Here's how to launch your PS5 into safe mode. Make sure your PS5 is completely turned off. There should be no light on the light bar. Press and hold the power button for about 7 seconds until you hear two beeps. Connect your controller with a USB cable and press the PlayStation button. Once you're in safe mode, you'll see a menu with several options. Start with option 5, Clear Cache and Rebuild Database. Select Clear System Software Cache to reset temporary files, kind of like restarting your SFI. Then, select Rebuild Database. This reorganizes your PS5 storage and fixes issues like installation or copying errors. Don't worry, it sounds intense but it's a quick process, usually under five minutes. Step three, adjust settings. If safe mode doesn't solve the problem, let's tweak a few settings for better performance. Go to settings, then save data and game or app settings. Under game presets, switch to performance mode instead of resolution mode. This reduces the load on your PS5 and can help games run more smoothly. One more tweak. Go to Screen and Video, scroll down to 4K Video Transfer Rate, and set it to minus 1 or minus 2, especially if you're using a 120Hz display. This adjustment can resolve certain graphical or crashing issues. Step 4. Update System Software Last but not least, don't forget to check for updates. If the error is software-related, updating your PS5 system software can make all the difference. In safe mode, select option 3 Update System Software and download the latest version. This ensures your PS5 is running the most stable firmware. Now, if none of these steps work, the issue could be specific to the game. In that case, you may need to wait for the developers to release a patch to fix it. And that's it. These four steps should help you fix the error on your S5. If any of these solutions work for you, let me know in the comments. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to Fix Netflix for more helpful tech tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.